Today, I'll share how I went from zero to half a million dollars worth of Tesla stock in one year. Welcome back to Investing in Darren. Click subscribe to stay updated to more videos on Tesla. I only started my investing journey in August 2020. In the years before that, I accumulated savings worth $150,000 as cash in my bank savings account. I didn't know any better and started my investing journey very late. My savings came from saving 30 to 40% of my monthly salary over three to five years. While I've had the desire to invest in Tesla for some time, a combination of procrastination and not knowing what to do led me to delay my plans. Working from home during COVID gave me and many others time to reflect and act on our long delayed plans. I created a brokerage account with a local bank and decided to act. I didn't use popular brokerage apps like Interactive Brokers despite their low trading fees because I wanted the simplicity of keeping all my assets in one location and I knew I wouldn't be trading much as a long-term investor. So in August 2020, I used $120,000 of my savings to buy my first 300 Tesla stock at an average cost price of $400 split adjusted. I bought it right before Tesla stock split on 31st August 2020. I felt very nervous and excited at the same time buying my first stock. Tesla stock rose 75% from August to December 2020. Like the two characters in the mural behind me planting the seeds in their bowl, I knew I wanted to buy more Tesla stock because I had conviction in its long-term future. Nobody can consistently predict short-term prices and I strongly agree with the perspective that time in market is better than timing the market. Stats show it's generally hard to time the market and most people earn more by holding the stocks for the long term. Because of that, most of us would benefit from a dollar cost averaging strategy, which is buying consistently over a period of time. My full-time job generates a steady stream of monthly cash flow. I decided to pool my cash and buy Tesla stock once every two months on average. And I've been dollar cost averaging on Tesla stock consistently throughout 2021. From January, March, May, June, July, September, November, and December. On average, I buy $20,000 worth of Tesla stock on each purchase. If you're just starting out on your investment journey or career, it's okay to dollar cost average in a smaller amount, say one to 5,000. Consistently buying Tesla stock over the past year has led me to own 540 Tesla stock today at an average cost price of $551. Based on Tesla stock price of $939 as of this recording, that's worth half a million dollars. All in, I spent $297,000 buying Tesla stock and made a 70% gain worth $209,000. While Tesla has grown a lot in recent years, I continue to have a strong positive outlook for the company in the years to come. I plan to continue dollar cost averaging and buying more Tesla stock every two to three months in 2020. I'll continue buying Tesla stock until the stock price hits $2,000. After that, I'll start accumulating funds to start investing in SpaceX through private funding round or wait for Starlink's IPO. While some say that Tesla's price earning ratio is very high at 250 compared to Apple at 31, I believe that Tesla's P-E ratio will continue declining over time as profit margins increase in its automotive business and as services and software like full self-driving and Tesla insurance continue growing. Some people believe that Tesla stock is overvalued and they like to say, Toyota sells 10 million cars a year right now, Tesla barely sells a million cars a year. As investors, it's important to understand the story behind the numbers. When we dig deeper, we can see that most of Toyota's factories and cars are for internal combustion engines while 100% of Tesla's factories and cars are EVs. One has a bright future, the other is fading away. I also believe that Tesla will outsell Toyota by 2027, when Tesla achieves an annual production run rate of 10 million vehicles per year. Ice car sales will decline sharply, and legacy automakers will take a few years to scale production of their EVs. Today, there are very few automakers coming close to Tesla's EV production. On top of that, Tesla sells every single car it makes, even here in Singapore, with the world's most expensive cars. Tesla's entry-level Model 3, the standard range plus, costs 140,000 US dollars in this country, three times more US prices. Despite that, 8.5% of all car registrations in Singapore last month were Tesla Model 3s, making it one of the most popular car models in this country. And I can see the change happening in front of me with my own eyes. Last year, there were only 41 Teslas on Singapore's roads. They were a rare sight. Now, it's common to see two to three Teslas in a single day. By the end of this year, we will have more than a thousand Teslas in Singapore, a 24 times increase compared to the year before. And all of this is just Tesla's automotive business. For long-term investors, we know that growth will come from Tesla's automotive business, Tesla Energy, eventually down the road, robotics, 
and AI. Buying Tesla is like buying an ETF. Investing in Tesla has been a life-changing decision for me. Even if Tesla stock price were to drop by another 35% today, that is still better returns than keeping money in a bank, which is what I did before. Whether you have 5,000 or 5 million in Tesla stock, what matters is its long-term trajectory. Pierre Faragou recently shared that Tesla is the only trillion dollar valuation company that has a 1% market share in its eventual addressable markets across automotive, energy, and AI. What's unique about Tesla's shareholders is that many also believe in Tesla's mission of accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy. Almost every automaker in the world, even Toyota now, is committed to making EVs a significant part of their business. Tesla played a big part in making this happen sooner rather than later. Investing in Tesla is also investing in a leader like Elon Musk, who cares more about changing our world for the better than profits alone. Elon was recently recognized as Person of the Year by Time and Financial Times. Always invest in money that you can afford to lose and don't need in the short term. And everyone's journey is different. It took Chicken Genius one day to buy what took me one entire year to accumulate in Tesla stock. And that's okay. Everyone has a different pace in their journey. I wish you all the best and invest safe. If you found this video useful, please click the like button. Hit subscribe to stay updated to more videos on Tesla. Take care and see you in the next one.